Hey guys, Chris Seinarg from Center Mass Group. Today in this video, I wanna to talk to you about your dominant eye and how it works when you shoot with both eyes open. If you've read my book or you follow my blog, you probably know by now that I'm a big proponent of shooting with both eyes open, but it's not the easiest thing to do, especially when you're starting out to really understand how it works. So in this video, I wanna try and clear some of that up and I'm gonna show you actually what I see when I shoot with both eyes open. So like I said, shooting with both eyes open can be pretty tough. It can be challenging if you don't know what that should look like when you're actually shooting with both eyes open. And I get a lot of questions on exactly how does it work. And the question normally goes something like, you know, I'm shooting with both eyes open, I'm trying it, but I keep seeing two sight pictures. How do I get rid of that second sight picture? Well, the truth is you don't want to get rid of that second sight picture. That's the whole point of having both eyes open. But you do need to train your brain to just see one sight picture and not pay attention to the other one because that's what your dominant eye is. Your dominant eye is what your brain pays attention to more because your brain has to make a decision between two pictures that it's receiving. One from your right eye, one from your left eye, and your brain has to decide, especially when it comes to very small distances, such as your front sight post, which one to pay attention to more than the other one. So you'll see that when I'm looking with both eyes open and I'm shooting, I see two sight pictures, but my brain is just paying attention to one. So your dominant eye basically has what's called ocular dominance. So that just means that your brain is paying more attention to the visual input from that eye than it is from your other eye. It doesn't mean that it's ignoring it. It's kind of like you're being either left-handed or right-handed. It's not that when you use your dominant hand, your other hand goes to sleep or doesn't work. It's just that you prefer using that hand over the other hand. They both work just as good. So that's how your dominant eye works. All right, so hopefully you learned something about eye dominance, how that works, and what we actually see when we're shooting with both eyes open. So you can make sure you do this dry fire, try it out, and teach your eye which picture you wanna see, and it'll help make you a better shooter. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.